there are people, there are men that humanity prevail. The men, I just might break it, give me a mic as well. There are there are men that humanity rebel. There are men that people give accolades to. There are men that people stand up for. There are men that say the word and then people swing into action because that particular man said said the word. And, and one of that man that I've discovered in history uh, most recently was called Nelson Mandela. Please let the, 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 the doctor reduce. Let the people outside come inside. We are about to close. I'm closing now. So. Number one of such men was Nelson Mandela. Nelson Mandela was a man that fought for the freedom rights of black race all over the world. Nelson Mandela was a man that in his lifetime it was recorded in history that he was the most influential man on the planet. Nelson Mandela had what we call goodwill. Take the keyboard up a little bit. Nelson Mandela had what we call goodwill. But he got to a time in his life and an, an age of his life that Nelson Mandela contended with death till today he is still there.
because I know that I can release my everything for him. You have been a Christian for 10 years, 15 years, yet you are still gathering well for the Antichrist. You will make it. God told me to raise selfless worshippers with a mandate. Some of you are music ministers here. The only thing you know how to do is to go to the studio, release sweet songs so that they can invite you and they'll pay. You want to blow. You want to blow. You really want to blow. That is the abomination that is hovering in the gospel music industry right now. For a gospel music minister to think that he wants to feature his secular minister. You cannot be with God and feature his secular And I'm not saying it because of emotion. I'm saying it via the revelation of God's word that I've got. You can't spend your life for God and the devil at the same time. It's not possible. As I'm talking now, there are three verses here that the Lord is giving me a dimension of glory. That after now, your music ministry is going to take a U-turn. Wait, wait. After now, I see African nations opening up for three verses here. Yeah. You don't understand. Three verses here. Lift your hands. Put an altar where you are. If you want to kneel down, if you want to sit down, if you want to lie down, I have seen you this morning.
evidence is not the big events that you go to. Evidence is the souls that your life has affected.